gotta be honest, when you're a mom and you have little ones at home, like little things make you cranky, anything. And let me tell you, I don't have just like one little one, I have two little ones. And uh, you know how that is. I don't know if there's moms out there, but let me tell you something, I had my kids back to back. And you know what I realized? When you have a baby and you get pregnant like a month later, no one says congratulations. <laughs> Seriously, everybody goes, get cable, you know? Like, I can't stop getting laid. That's what, that's what they're thinking, you know? And I so wish was, you know, that's so not true, but it sounds good, you know? Because I remember, I remember when I used to have sex for fun. Oh my God, I used to get into it, you know? Seriously, I was good. I was like, eh, eh, ow, eh, eh, ow, you know? Because that's how I would do it. And, um... <laughs> I don't mean to brag, but I was hot. That was my style. Oh. Sex is different once you have kids. It's insane. It is. And uh, seriously, because uh, I, you know what? To be honest, I don't know how you ever ha how you ever get pregnant once you already have a kid in the house. You know? Because it's true. It's like uh, you know, you go through the motions. You know, like your eyes are closed. You're into it. You're into it. But your whole house is full of toys, and every single toy makes a noise, and you can't get that crap out of your head, right? So you're into it. Your eyes are closed. Your mo, mo but all you can hear in your brain is the wheels on the bus go round and round, round and round. You know, and I'm getting into it round and round. You know, my husband's like, You're so hot. And I'm like, I just want to finish the song. You know, I can't make it stop. Ugh. And then, you know what else is weird? Talking in bed. That totally changes. I swear. Because the other day, seriously, it happened to you too? Oh my God. The other day, you know what I heard? I heard myself saying to my husband, I'm like, Good boy. <laughs> <laughs> then we almost got, you know, well, we did get done. And then I was like, I was so happy about it. I was like, yay, you did it. You did it. You did so good. Yes, you did. You did so good. Oh, I was so proud of him. I really was. You know, so I gave him a treat. And, um, you know, because I wanted him to remember. I'm like, there you go. Anyways. Yeah, it was fun. My boy. Anyways. Ah, so anyways, two kids for us, and that's good. I don't know, you know, I don't know that I'll ever have any more kids, because, uh, you know what, to be honest, it's hard to have sex. But, you know what, I take that back. I never wanted to turn into one of those women. It is hard to have sex, but I, I made a, a vow, like, I pledge that I will have sex with my husband, you know, whenever he wants, you know, um, as long as I'm asleep. Yeah. I will. I will do it whenever he wants, as long as I'm sleeping, you know, because, um, <laughs> I don't care. I know. I am totally, because you have to, you know, you have to, because you got a lot to do, and I'm a multitasker, you know what I'm saying? So it's just like, let's get it done. As a matter of fact, just the other day, I'll be, I'll tell you a story. Just the other day, he woke me up, it's like seven in the morning and he's like, rrr, rrr, you know, getting it on. And I swear to God, it's like seven in the morning. I'm like, okay. And we were almost done. And I was so happy. I leaned out of bed and I checked it off the list. And I, <laughs> I am so ahead of schedule. <laughs> One thing off the to-do list. That's it for me, you guys. Thank you so much for having me out.